Firstly, for uh, maximum immersion, ensure you are in a dark environment with no interruptions. Speaking of no interruptions, it's the reason why I haven't played this game yet and I have been wanting to so, 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 so very much. Every single time I sat down to try and play this amazing thing that I have wanted to play for so freaking long, I would get called away by my sister, I'd have to take care of the dog, some other type of work, or just some weird thing, something would come up and it would get in my way. And I did not approve of it at all. Because thanks to an incredibly amazing person who knows who they are, they got me this game, which is such an incredible gift, and I was just so happy and grateful, and I wanted to play it so badly, and I feel bad that it's been taking so long for me to get to this, because I've been wanting to play it so much, and it was so incredibly amazing of them, just out of the blue, to get this for me. I'm not really used to getting gifts, like, even when it comes down to, like, occasions when I should be getting gifts, like, holidays or birthdays, that kind of thing, like, it always, especially with people that aren't, like, related to me, it's usually been something that doesn't really happen. And it just was really, really cool, just an out-of-the-blue gift, and it meant a lot, and I'm still really grateful, so thank you. And in case you guys are wondering, as I kind of hopped in, I was I was jamming out to the screen music of the start, and it was just amazing. And Hoodle, this game, this incredibly amazing game, is Lone Survivor, the director's cut. And I'm so excited to be playing it. And, uh, just, oh, just, we're gonna get into it. We're, we're gonna get into it. We're just, we're just getting into it. it. It's, uh, secondly, audio is an important part of the experience, so be sure you use headphones or speakers turned up loud. Um, well, it sounds incredibly loud in my ears already, so we should be good. Finally, see what you need to see. Be yourself and enjoy the adventure. Uh, and, oh, I can change the gamma. Uh, it's started on three, or did it start on four or three? Oh, no. Oh, no, I don't know anymore. Um, I guess that'll be good. Hi, you guy, you have a face. One more thing. Please pick the phrase which best describes you as a player. Note that this setting cannot be changed once chosen. I'm new to this and I'm scared. I know my way around. Well, I'm new to this. Normal mode selected. Oh, I'm so excited. You. My name is... Not important anymore, I guess. <laughs> uh, used to know how long I'd been here. Now I've got no idea. Been a while since the uh, outbreak started. Nah, that much I know. Hold up with the sound of those things outside. Monsters, I guess you call them. As far as I know, I'm the only one left. The lone survivor. A title placement! Aw, that makes me happy. <clears throat> Immersion, right. <sighs> Can't go on much longer, though. All set of supplies. And if there's anyone else alive out there, I need to find them. If nothing else, I don't want to die alone. I'm here for you, dude. You don't have to be alone. Ooh, I just suddenly got a chill. Hey, it's me! How do I move? I use the arrow keys. Oh, wow, it's really dark. Oh, can I just say I love this freaking music? Oh, it's amazing. X to interact. There's a... I don't want to look at the armchair. I want to look at this guy. Talk to man who wears a box. Hello! It is actually a person. Just a quiet one. Hello? I guess you can't hear me. Hey. Why are you wearing a box? Nothing at all. Hi there! Hello! I want you to talk to me. I recommend the coffee. Hey, you did it! Thank you! You spoke! I guess I'll take your advice then. Because you were so kind and spoke to me. Uh... 
How's the armchair? I don't want to sit down right now. He recommended a cup of coffee. I don't really like coffee. Looks like a double espresso. Eh, he recommended the coffee. I'll drink the coffee. Yum. Lovely. Oh. Oh. Why did I listen to the guy who wears a box on his head? I think I can hear something down there. I guess it's down this way. Hello? Ooh, what's that staticky sound? It's like uh, the Resident Evil radio thing. Oh. What's going on here? I'd really. Ah, oh, hi. 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 You are a guy. You kind of have a cute face. Damn. It's one of those things. I don't think I can see me. Wait. Looks like there's a hiding spot just behind it. I'll see if I can sneak past. You know, I, I'm, I'm kind of noticing. It looks like this is a giant stage. Like, there's the curtain, and then it's revealing the act or the set. So, maybe things aren't quite as it appears here. Hello there, sir. You're a monster. But you can't see me, which is good. You must not be able to see very well. I'm gonna kind of try and be a little sneaky here. I mean, how do I get into hiding spots? Oh, X to hide. And then I need to hold... Oh, I don't need to hold X, but I can move while I'm in hidden. Ha ha ha, hiding. Yeah, sucker! What? I don't want to go back that way. Look at the curtains. I might as well go through. It really is like a giant act. There's a lady here. And the only thing I can do is to talk to her. Hello? Oh, hey, I did that. I, I predicted what you were going to say. In the exact manner you're going to say it, sir. We are already connected. Miss? I mean, come on. Hello? Do I know you? You look like you have a flower in your hand or something. Or pills. Are you okay? Pills are kind of going with this type of thing. What's that you're holding? Oh. Uh, kind of like a flashlight, maybe. Ah! It's a pocket flashlight. I was way off at first. Let's try switching it on. Oh, hi. Damn, my head. I've got a pounding headache. Damn, night terrors. No better than the other day. Oh, no better than the day. Well, good morning, flashlight, old friend. It's time to face the outside world. And the game saves. Uh, pick up green pill. I got some kind of green medicine. I don't know what you do. I don't want to use the bed. Uh, use the radio. Let's see if I can get anything. We, the survivors, praying for in 203. That's all I could get. Hmm, I wonder if I should head to 203 first. Maybe there's something alive in there. Read the diary. Let's have a look. Nothing exciting happened today. Tried to eat an insect I caught, but no use. Since it's just me now, I have to get out there. I need to find a weapon, something long range. Those sons of bitches are too dangerous up close. And I don't want their nasty disease getting on me. Then maybe I can get me something to eat. Oh, I remembered where I put their key. It's on the sofa in the living room. I don't know where the key for their bedroom is, though. That's what their last... There's something in written on the door and faint. Read it. Okay, let's see. Interacted shoot is X. Weapon toggle? Or weapon mode toggle? I guess there's different modes. I don't know. C. Walk and inventory? Oh, and one of inventory and space to open inventory. To save your game, use your bed. Flashlight is the F, which I figured. R is quick weapon reload and enter is map. I'm gonna forget these things. A and S are gamma. Q and W are aspect. No idea what that is. E is expert mode. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm totally gonna do that. P is pause. One, ignite a flare. Two, place rotting meat. And three, drink health tonic. I'll probably get used to this stuff as we're going through. 
Ah, it's locked. I need a key to open it. Oh no, I can't use the fire escape. Uh, hmm. Well, what do I have in my inventory? Which is space. I just have the green pill. And I have my flashlight at 100% battery. Uh, if I click X on it, look at the green pill. Some kind of drug, I think. Does not give me a hint. That is lovely. Uh, coat. I don't know whose it is. Yeah, it definitely doesn't seem like this is his place. These aren't mine. Yeah, none of these things seem to be yours. Oh, a battery! The painting. It's faded. Been a long time, I guess. It's locked. I need a key to open it. Oh, the bedroom, I'm gonna guess. Uh, here's the couch. Front door key. I got the key to 203. So, or, I don't know, 206 maybe is what it said. I'll sit down if I had a good enough reason to. Looking at the fridge. Wait, what's that smell? Even with my mask on, it's making me dizzy. Ah, eh, take what's inside. Let's see. I can hardly bear to touch this. It's piles of rotting meat. I'll take six pieces of meat for now. It's the most I can handle. Well, it did say there was a thing for it, so... Look at washing machine. Hmm. There's some kind of cat plush on here. Might as well take it. Piece of paper. It's some kind of diary page. Uh, if I go to my inventory, I can read it. It reads, I can't trust any of them anymore. Any of those bastards could be diseased. There's only the one way to survive this, and that's to put a bullet in every last one of their heads. That doesn't sound good. We all know what I'm saying is the truth. Let's not try and deny it anymore. I'll be waiting with the survivors. There's a name on the bottom, Draco. I don't know who this person wrote this. I'm more interested in the other survivors, if there are any. He doesn't seem to identify with this Draco. My stove. Don't remember it happening. But it still run a gas. I'll have to find some more. Anything else over here? I don't think so. I guess it's time for me to face the outside world. 